Yo, what is up guys? We're going to be running with the OG Catastrophe team with a little bit of upgrade being new mono. So I went back and I did upgrade and buy my girl Volante's outfits. I upgraded most of them. I still got to buy two weapons and two headpieces, but we're, we're doing what we can. We got the piece that gives her that, you know, 4% resistance. So right now her resistance on her own is 100.5% in geared. So I think that's high enough to just run evasion food with this team. I don't think you need resistance food. I think 100% resistance to her passive, where her nerfing that pierce rate by 100% is kind of overkill. So, if you guys are already the channel, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe, and we're gonna go ahead and get in this. So, yeah. Alright, let's do it. Game one. Full on team, of course. Well, I guess it's a good way to test out for how good she is, right? If I can get two merge? Um, maybe not. Okay, that's fine. Um, can we just kill Terry, though? Turn one, if we go like. This, this, this. Can we just get rid of the- Oh, I didn't check for- Don't heal, don't heal, don't heal. Okay. Oh yeah, we turned- Harry, you're, you're crazy. I got this. Stop. <laughs> He's like, no! Oh my god, what a loser. Uh, and fun. Imagine being a lame Oban. Fuck. Alright, so, I guess we'll continue on this journey of testing this comp out. Uh, they out CCS. That's to be expected. I did for evasion food. So the thing I want to test is I want to see if Valenti's defense card will help out Mono get more crits because Mono's just lowering their crit resistance and crit defense, right? With this level um, one defense down or level two defense down, it's twenty percent on top of that, which makes me think Mono should crit a lot more consistently with with this team. I know it seems silly, but just just hear me out on this. That guy's a dick, but it's fine. No damage done. We can just kill King. We didn't fuse until level two. Defense break. It's fine. We'll go like this. I'm gonna go like this. Maybe even maybe even Lily crits here because that's technically another. Huh. <laughs> okay, so it does work. That's pretty sick, actually. That's gonna be probably something I use a lot, is uh, Valenti using the defense down to get Mono to crit more consistently. That'd be really good against, like, Deanne. I can't really... I guess I could push the ultimate on Mono, but they only have one extra dupe on our cards. Unless he dissolves us here. He could. Rank up. Is this miss? No. I would have to have food for that. Okay, so we're just gonna kill the one, I guess, because I don't really care about anyone else. So, check our stats real fast. What's our crit chance looking like? Uh, 128%. Let's go. So we're gonna go do this, do this, and dissolve. Mono's gonna use a level one. She should crit every time here. Really nice, really nice. I think what we need on this team now is kind of Benny Morrow's AOE defense lower. I think we need that on this team. On like. On the next unit. I think that'd be a really... Like, I know the card does no damage. They could, I guess, change it to do damage. But that'd be a really cool card for this team. To make it where this team's even more consistent with those crits. Got his team. This will be fun. He'll heal out CC. Oh, maybe this is not a person. Okay. So, we just get rid of Margaret and we're good to go. That's a really good first start at hand to do so. Uh, he does have... Or, or, he does have the Relic for All of them, it looks like. What, does he have no gear on? What the hell? Okay. I mean, without Margaret, this team is dusted, so it doesn't matter. <clears throat> I know it's got itchy. It's weird. I don't- I don't- Attack for the- okay. Got my evasion. It's weird not having the force of the enemy to hit me. Like, I don't have to force him to hit me anymore. It's kind of nice, actually, now that I think about it. He didn't taunt, so who am I more scared of, to be honest? 6-6, six, six, Jesus. And you are... Well, I know who I'm going for. We'll go like this. Kill off that? I don't think so. My hand is really bad, so we get to delay the ultimate at least. I'm hoping this lowers his crit. This is a 
30% lower, so Mono should crit on the right left side really nice. Looks like everyone of those crits, nice. I have to remember Tarmiel Graces, if you hit him twice or whatever, you get disabled, so I gotta be careful with that. We can rush Mono Ultimate next turn, which is nice, so which I think I'll do is rush our Ultimate with all three cards up. I'll just attack lower them or whatever, so we get the full girth of Mono Ultimate. It's gonna hurt probably a little bit. Ah, uh, not really. Okay. So here's what we'll do. Our sure ultimate. And then... That. I want to see the ult damage. Oh, I'm blocked because of Tarmiel up early. That's alright. I gotta kill Tarmiel. Okay. They can't take my ult away, so we just gotta get rid of the Tarmiel or whatever. Though I don't want to kill it, to be honest, because it isn't really doing anything. But we should be fine to draw more cards. I guess. Try not to kill them. I think. Okay, now we can use our ult next turn. Uh, unfortunately, we did not draw another mono card, but we have three cards in our hand, so it should be fine. I want to ult with mono first because I don't want to get rid of those buffs, because it might actually kill them. I'm gonna be lowered here. It's unfortunate. It's fine. Okay, we'll get to see the ult with three cards in our hand. Six, six, ult, three cards. Should hit pretty free at heart. Oh, the heart went black. What the hell? 1.5 million damage. I think if you hit over a cap of damage, or it, maybe it's a skin. I think it might be this skin that's glitched, so... Yeah, it, it might be the skin. I'll switch skins. Alright, this will be the last game, guys. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Um, Alright, we're going second. We did fuse, though, so we technically could brush the ultimate on our mono. The issue is... We want to get rid of the Kyo. This will miss. Thankfully, they're dumb and didn't actually check. Unless they got two blood cards. Eh, I don't think we die. I don't think Rumor will do enough. His pierce rate's getting lowered. So, yeah. We get rid of Kyo, we're good to go. Which I think is possible to get rid of Kyo. Well, I imagine. What's your health at? Oh, yeah. Easily. So, what we'll do is... Like that, I guess. That should kill Kyo. If that kills Kyo, we kind of just win. Nice damage. Easily kill Kyo here. It's overkill, actually. Almost 200k on our level 2. Sick. We're pretty much full HP. I'll rush her ult next turn. Well, oh, shoot. Okay, we'll have to deal with that. Well, I guess I can rush. Well, I can, but... It's going a little tricky now. Because I didn't throw a second dairy card for her. They really don't like my mono. There's no point in ult rushing, I don't think. Yeah, how you like that Pierce Reagan lowered bitch? Alright. Let's go like this. Yeah. Crit, please. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, Valenti makes a big difference for that one unit to get destroyed. I think we just win here. I know Mono's probably dead, but we still have Lily ult coming up. Unfortunate that we got these two now. I would love to see um, her do that. It's okay, we just gotta kill the Lilia next, I guess, because Lily is being quite annoying. And then that's pretty much it. Unless they overestimate their damage and they ignore Mono. Please don't go for mono. They overestimated their selves. And now they're going to pay the price. So here's what we're going to do. I'm pretty confident in my play here. Uh, we have to kill him. We're going to fence lower. The bammy. And then... Do that. Model should tear these units up, right? Oh, hell yeah. 
That's a lot of damage for level 2. 348k. There you go, hold that. We are unable to heal, unfortunately, but Mono's still standing. They're gonna have to guarantee the kill on Mono now if they want to stop her. But honestly, she just shredded the... They, they're ignoring Mono, so I'm assuming an AoE is coming our way. Yep. Once again, Valenti's alive, so this won't hurt as bad. We got a Holy Relic on Valenti, Pog. We do lose the benefits from our crits and whatnot. I don't, I don't really care about her ultimate. So, we go like this. Um... I'm gonna debuff. Yeah, your Lilio isn't gonna do anything, my guy. If anything, I think we just kill your... Your dude here. Good game, though. Good game, though. I need, I need myself a new Mono sticker. I demand one at once. That'll be the last game for the day. I think that was a pretty good showcase. Mono's good, and she works with Valenti's defense lowering, so I do think base Valenti, if you want Mono to be... The most consistent she can be on her own team. Base Valenti will defense lower and the weak points will pop off. The AoE spikes will pop off on that unit that's defense lowered. I hope we get an AoE defense lowering unit in the future. Kind of like Benny Mara, but one that does damage potentially. Honestly, we don't really need it. I just think the defense lowering on top of the defense lowering is huge for that mono. That way she can uh, crit consistently. And yeah, uh, unless her Holy Relic does something like Q where it applies multiple of her debuffs on one unit. And that way you can just focus fire one unit at a time. I know a lot of people want a defensive relic, which I would be down with. I would be down with an AoE debuff too. There's so many different relics that she could, would be, which would be good. Basic stats, debuffs, defensive stats. Like the sky is the limit with new mono. Her old passive. Oh yeah. So yeah, I I love this mono. I think she's really really good, and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. She's impressing me more and more. I use her. So thanks for watching. Peace.